Um, Yami Lin and I met um, 11 years ago through mutual friends. She proposed, I said yes, of course, and uh, we got married in Canada and that was 10 years ago. So we face a country where for decades nobody talked about some human rights. The situation is complex because we still face any recognition under the law. Black, gay, woman. I'm checking a lot of boxes here. I'm, I'm, I'm you know, encountering a lot of denials and, and, and complexities. Um, we'd like to see everyone be able to pursue employment and be, you know, um, a part of, you know, what makes Panama great. Panama is a country that has changed dramatically um, towards recognizing the rights of LGBT rights and minorities. Um, we challenge all the political candidates to put on their agendas where they stand on human rights. The Office of the High Commissioner for Human Rights, we have been accompanying civil society organizations, uh, national institutions, uh, people affected to demand their rights. And we're very helpful that there's going to be a point, a time soon, where the Supreme Court is going to say, you are allowed to be married. Panama should carry that legacy of a country who supports human rights, not only here, but in the world.